what up boys and welcome back to another video so in this video we're gonna talk about something as simple as my personal favorite top three like group farms because a lot of you guys have been doing solo farming for a while now including myself i've done my fair share of solo farming and people are getting tired of skinning even though skinning still is absolutely insane so I'm gonna go to, uh, through my list of uh, videos that I've already uh, already featured, but like the top three ones that still works and uh, what they give, and like I'm gonna take them in uh, in order, like from uh, number three to number two to my favorite group farm uh, in Shadowlands. So the number one is this one right here. That is the uh, the rain there two times four uh farm and it's mainly for the uh, tenebrous ribs and the shadowy shank now keep in mind that this one if you have skinning like i explained in the video this one is absolutely insane uh however when you do it with randoms there's going to be a lot of people that want to skin so it's tough but when i do it uh and if i invite only people that don't skin i will make easily like 120 150,000 gold an hour just like 100% that's what I'm gonna make because that's without epics you're killing a lot of mobs so you also have a, a relative okay chance of epic uh not as good as some other spots though but you're still killing a bunch of mobs so if you're not the skinner you're gonna make all of your gold on the the rips and the shanks and you definitely want to use cooking to make it into the aspect the food uh in order to make a higher gold per hour but great spot if you can skin it's an insane spot and this one right here by the way i'm going to leave the links to all of these videos down below in the description but uh that one specifically takes place on the reindeer route the skinning route but it's like right down here like one uh mark down here and then one up here that's where you want to do it and you need to do it in the two times four so uh the next farm that we want to talk about is uh the spider farm in revendreft it's uh kind of similar to the uh, the one that i just had like the uh reindeer one but this one is decent doing it as a five man instead of a two times four it's obviously better as a two times four but a five man is still pretty damn good now this one only drops the creeping crawler meat it doesn't drop double meat like the uh the previous one however the shanks are almost worthless though but it is the, the both of the mats required to uh required in cooking uh, the creeping crawler meat usually doesn't sell for as much as the ribs but it's close however on this one you kill more mobs per hour especially like even the five man you kill more mobs per hour at this one than you do at the, the previous one and if you have a two times four you kill it way more but same as the last one if you have skinning you're gonna make a shit ton of gold it's really good really really good you get a ton of kills per hour and this one specifically it takes place in Revendreft, as I said, and it's under this bridge right here under uh, Dark Haven. Really good. Link to that one is also down in the description. So the uh, number one farm, before we dive into that one, I do want to mention that you guys can still get the uh, 0 to 10 million gold guide for 50% off just by typing the uh, code Shadowlands into the discount field before checkout. And the link to that is down below in the description. Uh, and this is a book that I'm going to const... I have been constantly updating it for months now. And I will keep on constantly updating it for a year. So if you've bought the book, uh, you will receive automatically uh, every single update that I uh, do on the book for free. So the last one is one that I've been doing a lot of lately. And that is the... Uh, the new insane gold farm it's not new anymore but it's the bastion two times four for epics cloth and raw gold now the reason why this is still my favorite farm is because of if you don't get an epic you're still making forty thousand gold per hour i do a lot of live streaming uh of this location and people are always shocked when i say that i make uh at least like guaranteed forty thousand gold per hour but it's really simple if you have a decent group two times four group uh, you get like 10,000 gold raw just from vendoring greens, gray items, and just the raw gold pickup. So that's 10,000 gold. Then you also get, with a decent group, you average like uh, 300 lightless silk. And lightless silk is usually 90 to 110 gold each. So that's like 30,000 gold. So you got 40,000 gold now. And then you also get like 3,000-ish uh, of the shrouded cloth. So you get like... 
uh, three to four thousand gold on those as well and that's without an epic and if you get an epic even if it takes you five hours to get an epic but when you do get an epic you get an epic that sells for 100k 100k divided by five like the amount of hours you spent that's an additional 20k per hour right so that means that you've been making 60,000 gold an hour so it is by far my uh, number one uh, two times four farm or recruit farm in shadowlands and the location for that one takes place all the way up here in bastion you're literally just running in circles around this location right here killing uh killing mobs with two groups four people in each group and uh, we don't even use a monk we just have eight druids running laps around in a circle so um i guess that's pretty much it that's my top three uh current shadowlands gold farms as of now they might change we might find new ones but right now that is definitely my top three so thank you guys so much for watching and if you have any suggestions for uh what video i should make next then leave it down below in the uh the comment section and i will see all of you guys back in on the next video but until then bye bye